Draft night was finally here for the New York Mets, and they got the guy a lot of Mets fans wanted, Kumar Rocker, with the 10th overall pick out of Vanderbilt University. In this video, I'm going to talk about Kumar Rocker, my reaction to it, and what it means for the Mets going forward. Because when it comes to baseball, you draft a guy, he's not going to be here tomorrow or next month. It's going to be a couple years for most prospects. If you enjoyed this video and you're glad that I'm back, I'm telling you, the second half resurgence, I am back. Make sure to leave a like. Comment down below, what is your reaction to the Kumar Rocker signing? I know you're excited, but tell me why you're excited. Give me some insight as to what about Kumar Rocker's makeup that has you intrigued. And if this is your first time watching or you want to make the night even better for me personally, you can always press subscribe. It's free. Makes my day. But as the draft developed, all of a sudden, Kumar Rocker was becoming more of a realistic possibility with each passing pick. And when he was available at 10, the Mets jumped on it. This tells you that he was a really sought after player for them. When you watch Rocker's highlights, he's a fun guy to watch. This is a big man and he's pretty nimble. Even though he's a bigger guy, he still could move around a lot. And I do like the stuff that he possesses on the mound. I mean, he has a fastball that could get to upwards of 98, maybe even 99, but he really has a wipeout slider, a relief pitcher like slider. And if you have that as a starting pitcher to generate a lot of strikeouts, that leads to good things. You don't have to worry about how bad your defense is if you're just striking everybody out. What I like about Rocker is this year in college, he had 179 strikeouts to only 39 walks. That's a really good strikeout to walk ratio. And if you're doing that as a young pitcher, I mean, that's a really good sign because you don't want a guy who comes in here that, yes, he has a good fastball. Yes, he has a nice wipeout slider. But if you're walking the ballpark, you're not as intriguing. And for people who like ERA, he had a 273 ERA this year. And he's coming from a great program in Vanderbilt, which is known for producing really good pitching like Jack Leiter who was the second pick in this draft. Another thing I like about Rocker and particularly with the Mets is his energy that he has on the mound. When he gets a big strikeout he's pumped up he's yelling you know very reminiscent of Marcus Stroman and that kind of energy. He will feed off of the New York crowd. When the New York crowd is loud and passionate Akuma Rocker is going to be loud and passionate with us. So he's a guy that I'm really excited to see whenever he is in the rotation or whether that's 2023 or maybe after maybe even before because Rocker is 20 21. He's not one of these guys that, you know, he's 19 and still has a lot of development to go. Another thing that is important to mention when it comes to drafting any starting pitcher is Kumar Rocker is yet to have Tommy John surgery. You do feel that, that is eventually going to happen. Look at what Mets prospect Matthew Allen is doing with. He had to have Tommy John surgery, so we're not going to see him for a little bit either. How the Mets get to the World Series in 2015, they did it with young starting pitching. So this is just another young starting pitcher, and he's really good. And I'll tell you what, getting a guy like Kumar Rocker makes the disappointing season of 2020 feel slightly better because at least there was a nice reward at the end even though the Mets didn't do as good as we had hoped for in 2020. As far as future content I have a video coming out later this week five trade options for New York Mets some trades I would like to see them make that I really believe could help the team on guys that are available also obviously Mets weekly on Thursday this time will be on Mets fans channel I'll have that in the description but hopefully you guys enjoyed this video can't wait to see Rocker take the mountain queen so until the next one be safe be smart, be healthy, and let's go Mets. We got Kumar Rocker, baby!